Hi, I'm Brian Harris, and I'll give you an operational update of the Devil's Knob Fire for today being Wednesday, August 18th. Uh, so just a little bit of a reference. Uh, uh, we are managing uh, all the fires that are on the Umpqua National Forest that are a part of the Rough Patch Fire, uh, the Jack Fire, and of course the Devil's Knob Fire, which is right here. Uh, Reference-wise, this is the Near Binky Fire, which is part of the uh, Rough Patch. And then as we move over here to the Smith Fire, this is the fire that we uh, saw a fair amount of activity on on Monday, and it really did pick up uh, uh, several thousand acres. It did make a run about four miles to the southeast. It did jump over the uh, uh, south fork of the Umpqua River. There's about a hundred acre uh, spot fire out here. We do have crews focused on this area today, and our intent is to hopefully get a line around those spot fires so that they don't continue to move. Uh, generally, overall, uh, again, our objective here is, is to not allow the fires to move to the west, so we have fav favorable uh, wind and weather conditions to prevent that from happening. Uh, but we do have uh, contingency primary and alternate lines out here to prevent the fires from moving to the west. Um, on the Hamlin fire and all the rest of the fires that are part of this, uh, this piece right here, we're really approaching these fires as one fire from an operational standpoint. Uh, so our intent again is to, is to get primary and alternate uh, lines around this. Now some of these are indirect, some of them are direct but we'll take every opportunity that we can to, uh, to go direct to hold the fire into place. Uh, I do want to touch on the fires down here. These are the Wildcat fire uh, and the various different fires down in there. These are actually looking really good. Uh, so we did have a little bit of activity kind of on the east, southeast side of some of these fires down here. Right now they're holding in place and they're looking really good.